Hello, I'm Jay Wright, coach of the Villanova Wildcats. As we all know, motion our signature to college basketball. NCAA Basketball 2010 by EA Sports debuts the Motion Movement Control. Once you're in formation, by tapping the Motion Movement Control, your players will quickly run a play which is unique to your motion offense. There are many different types. The dribble drive, which allows players to be creative at attacking penetration, followed by the kick out or lob pass is what we're looking for. The four out motion is probably the most common motion offense in college basketball. Typically, you'll see lots of screening in this offense, but one of the keys is timing. When a cut or a screening action is happening, the ball must be delivered in a timely fashion. Stress inside play, but having an inside presence will definitely help. The five out offense for teams who have post players with perimeter type skills. This forces post defenders to leave the paint and guard his man on the perimeter. This offense really opens things up in the quarter court and will allow for back cuts and a lot of penetrate and kick opportunities. With the right mix of players, this offense can be a lot of fun to play and very difficult to defend. The Princeton offense requires all five players to be on the same page. It's not necessarily a slow offense, but is a series of quick hitter plays and reads. This offense will open things up in the quarter court. At times, the post player is situated in the high post area, about 15 to 19 feet from the hoop. A post player who can pass and make good decisions on the perimeter will be successful in this offense. Look for screens, misdirection type plays, and most of all, the back cut. Play too aggressive on the perimeter and you'll be burned on the back door cut. The flex motion offense utilizes a cut called the flex cut. This aggressive screen and cut action typically starts in the baseline corner. The cutter will use the screen and flash across the left side low. Having multiple players who can post up is a definite bonus. The three out, two in motion is a great offense when you have two post players who are really skilled inside. Occasionally, the post players will step out to the perimeter to set screens. However, the guards have to know how to use the screens, know when to cut and how to maintain good spacing. If not, the post players will not be good. pass or he'll wait for a screening action to take place. Zone motion offenses will help you attack zone defenses. If you're facing an odd man zone like a 1-3-1 or a 3-2, try out the three low motion offense. This will position players on the sign and two up top. Use the two low motion offense when going up against a 2-3 zone. Two low will position two players down low, two players on each wings and one up top. Either way, the key to attacking the zone is through overloading a side and passing into the high post. Pass into the high post and watch how the defense collapses into the paint. This will free up your shooters who are spotting up on the perimeter. The opportunities are endless, but it's up to you to read and react to the defense. NBA Basketball 2010's Motion Movement Control.